What's up my VR bears and welcome to today's video. In today's video I'm going to be teaching you how to downgrade Beat Saber. That way you are able to get BMBF even though the latest version of BMBF has not quite been updated yet. This video was made in collaboration with Computer Elite. We've had some DMs across Discord talking about how we're going to make this video. He's going to check over the script, basically write it all himself. He's also going to do all of the editing and clip gathering. So make sure you guys send him some love in the comments down below. But basically he's doing most of this video I'm just going to talk about it and upload it on my channel for you guys to view. There is a couple reasons why we're doing this, one of which is the fact that it's going to be a better video this way. This way, all of the information you know will be right, and that it is going to be more accurate than if I were to make the video on my own. Secondly, this will allow us to get out the video more quickly, that way you guys can get help sooner about how to get VMBF back for your Beat Saber. With that being said, if this video ends up helping you out, make sure you hit that like button and share it with someone else who might want to try and get BMBF back on their Beat Saber so they can play with some custom songs. And with that, let's hop into the video. APK Downgrader is a program which can only work on Windows and can downgrade Beat Saber and in future more apps to various versions. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to use the downgrader so that you can downgrade your game. I will also be showing you how to create the downgraded files for other people to use. A few words before we start, you'll need a Windows PC with SideQuest installed. I have made a video about this, it will be linked down in the description or you can click the I up in the top right. Along with that, you'll also need your Quest and a cable capable of plugging your Quest into your PC. The program may freeze sometimes, especially when downgrading or creating downgrades. This is normal and you shouldn't panic. Just wait a bit and it should respond again. And please note that this video will eventually get outdated. Check the title to see if it is. You will always find up-to-date information, supported, downgrades, as well as most of the errors APK Downgrader can give you on the Computer Elite Wiki, which is also linked down below. Currently, as of making this video, no one has been banned for downgrading a game on their quest with this tool. If you get any errors while downgrading, skip to the time shown on screen. With that said, however, downgrade at your own risk. The first step is to download the program. For this, go to the GitHub that will be down in the description and click on releases at the bottom right. From there, download the first file, which says apk.downgrader.zip. After you downloaded the file, you will find it in your downloads folder. Right click it and click extract all. Then hit extract and a window should open with a few files. From here you can double click APK downgrader to start the program. You may get a window saying Windows protected your PC. If you see this, click more info and then run anyway. It should then open. Check for updates and download xdelta3 which is a required program to downgrade to many versions. You can easily downgrade your game with just a few clicks. First connect your Quest to your PC via USB and open SideQuest. Once you've done that, you should see a green dot in the upper left corner of SideQuest. If not, your headset is not connected and you may need to turn on developer mode. If you already have developer mode on, make sure you click allow ADB bugging in the headset. If you're having any issues, feel free to leave a comment below this video. Once you've done that, you can now close SideQuest. Quick note, if you aren't downgrading Beat Saber for the audio downgraded version, you'll need to change the appid.txt file to your app if you aren't downgrading Beat Saber. Now start APK Downgrader if you didn't already. You will see one box labeled targeted version and there you put the version to which you want to downgrade to. For example, we'll put in 1.13.2 as that is the latest version that can currently be modded. Then you press auto downgrade and everything will go by itself. If this is your first time downgrading to this version, you'll get a prompt asking if you want to download a file, click yes, then the program will do one of two things. Either it'll download everything itself or ask you to download the file. If you are asked to download the file, simply press OK. Your browser and explore window will open. Then download the file from your browser. 
after it is finished find it again in your download folder and drag and drop it into the explorer window apk downgrader opened that will be the folder labeled downgrade files after you did this press auto downgrade again and this time it should downgrade your currently installed version on your quest and then install the downgraded one after the apk got downgraded you will be asked if you want to keep your game data in the case of Beat Saber, this is for scores and settings. So if you want to keep them, press yes. Beat Saber will be uninstalled and the downgraded version installed. There is also a second option to downgrade. This one is for people who have already have had an APK, which you can back up on SideQuest, for example. Again, open the APK downgrader, but this time click choose APK in the window that opens up browse for the APK you backed up. The program will then get the APK version and package ID. You can then put in your target version as before I will use 1.13.2. You can then press start downgrading to start the downgrading process. If you get a prompt which asks you to download something, go back to the time shown on screen. After a few seconds, on average it'll be around 30, it was around 30 seconds for me, Explorer should open up with a downgraded APK highlighted. You can then install this APK to your quest through SideQuest. If you have an old version of an app you want other people to enjoy, then you can create downgrades yourself. For this, you'll need an old version of the app and a new one from which you want everyone to be able to downgrade. Start the APK downgrader and shift click choose APK. This will let you know that you want to create downgrades. Then first browse for the APK you want people to downgrade from. In this example, I want people to be able to downgrade from Beat Saber 1.15 to 1.12.1. So I'll select the 1.15 APK first, press open, a second window will appear. This time browse for the version you want to downgrade to. In this example, the 1.12.1 APK. You can then start the downgrading creation via start downgrading button. You'll be asked if you want to use the X Delta 3 or the old X or method. Press yes to choose the X Delta 3 method as this will result in a smaller file. Then after a bit it will finish and you can find the downgraded file in the downgrade files folder next to the executable. If you want to publish it, upload the downgrade file to a file hosting site like Mega, Dropbox, or Google Drive and create an issue on the GitHub repository. As a template, choose the downgraded edition. You then want to locate versions.json or just versions if you don't have file extensions enabled. Open it with Notepad or any other program. Then find the part which says SV as the version you want. In our case, 1.15.0 and TV as the version. In our case, that would be 1.12.1. Copy the section until source byte size followed by numbers and paste it into the part which has two curly brackets in the issue. Then add your download link, create the issue and Computer Elite will review it and add it as soon as he can. You might get some errors while doing the downgrading process. I'll show you some of the most common ones now. The version downgrade isn't available for those versions. This means the version you are trying to downgrade to can't be downgraded to yet as the required files are not yet public. You can also check to which version you can downgrade to by clicking show available downgrades and selecting an app. Then you can see every available downgrade. Your APK may be corrupted. Please get a fresh copy of it and try again. If this pops up, either get a fresh backup of your APK via SideQuest or press auto downgrade again if you use that button as it will put a fresh copy in. Install failed version downgrade on SideQuest. You can fix this by simply uninstalling Beat Saber before you install the downgraded APK. More errors do exist and you can read about them on the wiki linked in the video description. 
If you have any problems while downgrading, make sure you take a look at the wiki, which you can use to find a bunch of different information. Along with that, also read through the entire video description and read through some of the comments down below. Also, feel free to join my Discord in the description where you can ask for help under the VR help section. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully this helped out a little bit. Mods currently get somewhat messed up when trying to downgrade. So if you downgrade your version, you might need to reinstall those core mods. Sometimes you can fix a problem by just going to quick fix under the tools tab in BMBF. Hopefully this video helped you out. If it did and you want to see more, make sure you subscribe. Thank you to my members. You guys are absolute mad lads. From my little lettuces to my mama bear help. Thank you. Thank you so much help for supporting the channel for seven months now. It's been a huge help and allows me to do what I want to do. Feel free to leave a comment down below telling me if this tutorial worked out for you and don't be afraid to ask questions. I try and read every single comment. With that being said, that is going to end off today's video. Hopefully you enjoyed and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out everybody. Bye.